is not a better love story on this game than the Panthers and trying to get a 1-2-6. And so we are back again today to try and get said 1-2-6. What's up, guys? The Panthers here, and welcome back to another draft challenge video. We are going to try our very best today in the four. Oh, she went to rhyme it, never mind. In the four attempts that we'll take to get a 1-2-6. Maybe the draft gods are on our side. It is very painful. I can't lie. Like, 1-2-6 has actually been available since Team of the Year. They were super rare, super hard to get during Team of the Year. As time's gone on and lots more players have been added into the game, they've got progressively easier. And lots of you guys were sending me, you know, screenshots. Oof, that's why I didn't take that. Salah, you see. Were sending me screenshots of you getting a 1-2-6 from January through to uh, where we are now at the back end of March. And that in itself was a bit like, oh, man. Oh, man, let's go. That was in itself was a bit like, oh, man, when, when am I going to get a 1-2-6? It's even more painful over the last sort of like seven to ten days because everybody is getting 126s but me. If you want to be able to afford the best players and open the best packs in FC24, go to u7buy.com to buy your EAFC24 coins. It's cheaper than buying FC points and just as reliable. They already offer some of the best prices out there, but you can get an extra 6% off using promo code NEP at checkout. Now we can play that right mid in a am if we need to. LA can't go center mid though, so we'll pop a Ramirez in there. That's great for chemistry. All right, I'm feeling this, to be fair, guys. This is a great start. Imagine hitting it on the first one. We will put a Renard in there. French links are very tasty. Zinchenko because of chemistry, I think. Got to change our right back out. This is where it gets tricky. Ooh, not so much anymore. The defense is always the big problem. And to be fair, this back line... Is still not great, but it is good. We will go with uh, Jimenez right there. Um, yeah, this team is okay so far, but we are going to need a little bit more. We'll take the goalkeeper last so we know who we're looking for in the back line. I'm going to need a right back as well just to get some chemistry, aren't I? We'll take uh, Coivisto because she'll, she should get full chem. She gets two chem. She'll be close to full chem. Hopefully, she's not in the team at the end. Makes a lot of sense. Bronze up to a 90. Good card, but we've got to take a 93 where possible. No chem change on him. Yeah. Big boy Rivaldo. Doesn't get into the team, mind you. It's the back line that we need to improve upon, really. Van Basten, Mane and Pires as well. We'll take Sadio Mane. The old Liverpool past and present. Mane could go up front, but very difficult to link chemistry to. Last pick here. This is an alright setup, to be fair. We'll take 94 Erling Haaland. We lose three chem if we start him, so we won't be doing that. All right, let me, let me get a goalkeeper. We're going to need a Premier or the League goalkeeper. Or an Icon would be ideal. Yeah, Ter Stegen's actually perfect. He takes us up to 31 chemistry. We need a Uruguayan to get Jimenez on full chem. And we need a Premier League right back, and we're good. Or a La Liga right back, and we're good. Or an Icon right back, and we're good. Or a Rude Hullet. And that actually might help quite nicely. Pull it over Renard, we lose three. Put those bad boys around, we gain four. We are now just a Uruguayan or La Liga manager away from full chemistry. But we are only 91 rated. And we have a really low rated right back. That's not what we want to see. This bench is now at that stage as well where it's really hard to upgrade. See how good these drafts are now, though, guys. Like, this isn't even a great draft, and we're still most likely going to get a 92 rated. It would be if we uh, if we had a right back. Maybe I should have taken bronze after all. Um, I bet you if Huth goes in there, I bet you... Yeah, see, that would have been 92 rated. 
One, two, fives are coming through thick and fast. But of course, that is not what we need. So we'll get into attempt number two. All right, guys, attempt numero B. Let's go with the four triple two. Lots of high rated cams in this game now. Lots. Uh, we'll start with Marquinhos at centre back. I know it's not his best version, but it's good to get an 88 rated striker in there. And I will take him, uh, sorry, Kylian Mbappe as well. It's so rare that we get his team of the year version anyway. Take Ian Wright. And he gets that PSG link to uh, Marquinhos, which is obviously superb. But not what we're at. oh see this Pele's coming out thick and fast baby come on give me a big card here yes please we'll take ninety one rated Yaya Torre and go with Xavi Alonso alongside him which is quite nice chemistry is going to be real tidy on this uh, this draft now take eighty eight Karchawi the PSG links as well just great for it and we'll go with. Uh, Probably Copete gets triple chemistry because they're La Liga and Spain links. Then in at right back, we will go with Saucy Pedro, who does well because of the uh, icon and Spain links. And in goal, we'll go with Lev Yashin. This, this draft picked itself there. We, I think we're on full chemistry, are we? 32 out of 33 chemistry. We just need some rating now, yeah? Just give me some big cards. Just like that. Teo Hernandez left back. In he goes. We don't lose any chemistry on him, so that's great. Number two on the bench will take an 85 Mittelstadt. He started for Germany against France, actually, didn't he? We've got Keen or Pires. Keen only goes DM. Pires also has Cam, so we'll take Pires, pop him in there, and that gives us full chemistry. This is a really nice draft to play with. It's not the highest rated. We're going to need some big, big cards. 89 Jamal Musiala is not enough. We need some like 95 pluses, really. Uh, Gianfranco Zola can go onto the bench. This is probably going to be another 125. Oh, nice. Johan Cruyff over Kylian Mbappe. Doesn't have Cam on this card, which is a shame. We've got another team of the year there. Team of the year, Hansen. That's going to take us to a 91, I'm sure. It does. But we are still short like two or three monster cards. I will take Messi. It doesn't upgrade the bench by much, but I think it might take us to a 92. It doesn't quite. Three more picks to go on this one. D Marco. Two more. Wow, well, we're going to get dead picks now, aren't we? Still got an 88 round Felix, which goes in over Mittelstadt. That centre back doesn't help either. But again, here we are again, guys. It's not even a great draft, but it's a 1 2 5 again. 1 2 5s are becoming incredibly common and incredibly easy. Which therefore means one, two, six. It's on the cards for me. We just haven't hit it yet. All right, guys, as we go into attempt number three, it would be nice to get a formation with three cams. The four, two, three, one would be superb. There's the four, two, three, one wide. The more cams, the better for us, really. One of them have it. I'm going to go with the false nine. Don't know why. It just feels like the right thing to do. Our captain choice is less than. Uh, Fantastic there. Michael Owen being the best option for us. Our centre forward is regular Johan Cruyff. In amongst regular <coughs> regular golds there as well. I'm not going to take Mohamed Salah. Because he's got way high rated cards. And that teller is also almost the same rating as Mohamed Salah. Oof. Team of the year Jude Bellingham. This card is just so good isn't it? Four star, four star. Unbelievable stats and very good play styles. I wonder what team of the seasons are going to be compared. Excuse me, to the uh, team of the years. We'll go with Guardado for the uh, links to Bellingham. Nice set of icons. See, this is an all right draft. I worry with drafts like this, though. We're getting like 91s, 93s, 89s. We need the, those ones to be like two or three ratings higher so that when we get the low cards like this, it's all right. I'll take Karchawi. Um, you know, we need the high cards to be like the biggest cards. Take De Almeida as well. That's perfect chemistry for Karchawi in there. Hopefully. And again, here we go. This back line. Just not gravy, is it? Just not gravy. An 87, an 88, an 82, and an 85 rated CDM. Thankfully... 
Philippe Lahm saves us for two reasons. Number one, he's 92 rated, goes in that back line. But number two, he can go in at DM and left back if we get somebody much better elsewhere. Goalkeeper is tragic. 30 chemistry, 90 rated, terrible draft so far. I can't even lie. Slightly saved with Van Nistelrooy. We get one chemistry off of him, but this rating is miles off of what we need it to be. We will take Salma Basha. Put her at left back for right now. She can go left wing, which is quite nice. We'll take Frankowski. This is such a mid-draft, isn't it? Go Bernardo Silva, 91. Doesn't get into the team, mind you. Never mind. A little bit saved. A little bit saved. 94 Pushkas over 93 Cruyff. I wonder if this is still going to be a 1-2-5. Let's see. Uh, Messi has Cam, centre forward and striker. Not ideal, but again, the highest rated there by some distance. So we'll take him. We've got Ben's 92. Once again, not great. Doesn't even have a certain 91 rated squad yet either. Wow. We've got Kent. He doesn't even get onto the bench. Oh, this, this draft is genuinely abysmal. Been at Zola. Oh, dear. Right, note to self, guys. Do not take... The 4 3 3 5 ever again. That is horrific. That is horrific. If I get the chemistry, which I can't anyway, it would have only been a 1 2 4. That is such a bad draft. Uh, manager doesn't even matter. Let's get into the fourth and final attempt. Alrighty, guys, here we go with the fourth and final attempt for today. We get the four triple two or the four five one attack. Let's go for the four triple two again. Hopefully, we get that 97 Pele again. We'll start with 92 Zico. Not bad. The striker is bad. Second striker is also bad. I'll go with the icon there out of all of those choices just for chemistry. And the cam is bad. Oh dear. Well, this is going to be hard to recover. 89 Kante, very good. Tomorrow's not bad either. Obviously, the ice cards get great chemistry, but so do the, uh, the radioactive cards as well. Good chemistry coming in. We do get 90 SEM, but just like I said in the last draft, guys, these 90 rateds and 92s and stuff, they're good to have in the team, but you need the big cards. We've got another Philippe Lahm, second draft in a row. I need, like, team of the years here. Oh, well. So, with two incredible defenders out of the four so far, you're now saying there's a chance. Go with Pasquero because of the chemistry of the Renard and the icons, of course. And we'll also go with Mendy. French chem, real nice. We'll go with Donnarumma in goal. He gets two chem points. Uh, thanks to the icons. All right, it's 90 rated, 31 chemistry. Other than that one gold card, it's not awful. But it is going to be hard to really get together. Not awful. It's, it's just like unremarkable, isn't it? It's just a bit meh. Oh, I shouldn't have taken that frimpong. Should have waited for the team of the year. It's just all a bit meh. We've got David Beckham, although he can't get into the team. We've got 94 Rude Hullet. That's more like it. Pop him up there. Gives us one extra chem point. Is not going to be overly helpful with the uh, with the rating. Karim Benzema should be, though. Okay, we can actually put Trezeguet back in as well, which will be even more helpful for the chemistry. That leaves Donnarumma needing an Italian manager. Or a La Liga manager. No, French league manager. Beg your pardon. We'll take Trent. Not that he works. We have got team of the year, Allison, who does give us full chemistry. 
Um, we can also now go for Trent in this team, which will upgrade the rating a little bit. Not a lot, though, but a little, a enough to get this to a 1-2-4 at the very least. Yeah, we're a 1-2-4 again. Three picks to go now. I have a feeling this is going to be three dead picks. Ooh, my feeling was wrong. What do we say for chemistry with that Messi? We lose one. We just need an Argentinian manager to get it back. Next up, 90 Diogo Jota, over 87 Frimpong. One more pick to go. I like the fact these purple cards come out in dead picks. Kind of makes the dead picks a little bit more decent option. Now, usually, guys, I only do four attempts. But today, we're going to go for a fifth. We get another one, two, four. Today, we're going to go for a fifth. A bonus attempt because it. I feel like it's here. I feel like I'm due. All right. The fifth and final attempt. Let's do the 5 2 1 2. The five backs are good. Now that we've got way better midfielders and attackers, I'm always a bit reluctant to do it. But they are good. We are going to need a better left wing back. We could put Ronaldinho into camp. Oh. Start me off right, EA. Come on. We don't mind 92 Van Nistelrooy either. Go on, give me the other. No, give me Pele. Don't give me the other Ronaldinho. Give me Pele. Right, 91 Shearer in there as well. Maybe Haji would have been a better pick there, actually, because Shearer, like Haji could have played centre mid, which would have been nice. I'm going to take 91 Aitana Bonmati. I'm going to take 93 Patrick Vieira. The icons on this team are outstanding. Oh, my days. Thunderstruck Cafu as well. Now we're going to get the... Yeah, now we're going to get the dead picks, right? Now it's going to be dead... Oh, Team of the year, Ruben Dish. Oh, team of the year, right? All right, all right. This has got some hope. Obviously, I need a better goalkeeper, a left wing back, and a better centre back. Ronaldo is about as good as you could have hoped for in a dead pick there. Interestingly enough, we lose chemistry with Ronaldinho in there because Bright loses the English link. Okay, there's our left wing back. That's great. We lose more chemistry with him as well. 92 Rivaldo. Doesn't help the team in any way. Let's risk our goalkeeper now. I need an icon here, EA. We didn't get it. I think Pope's going to actually be the best option here. The English and Premier League links get us up to 31 chem. He leaves a short on chem on Ruben Diaz, which is either a Portuguese player or a Premier League manager. Short on chem on Aitana Bonmati, which needs a Spanish link. Yeah, de definitely thinking Haji might have been a better option. Um, And we need a new centre-back because that centre-back is Garbo. Tempted to take this Ramos. Not going to. I'm going to take Dembele. Come on, EA. Five picks. Nice me. Well, that is quite nice. I can't lie. A big rating upgrade there. We're already at 91 rated, guys. It might even be 92. It's already 92 rated with a 75 rated centre back in the team. Nice me, EA. <sighs> Sabio will come on in. And he does offer one extra chemistry. Goalkeeper and centre back are solo rated. The bench is incredible. There's nothing I can do. I don't have another centre mid. Nothing I could do to improve this team right now.
what ratings is go to. Still a 92. Wow. Guys, that centre mid has genuinely... This might even be a 94 overall team. If I put in just the highest rated cards. We then put these guys on there. It's a 93 rated squad, guys. But we are not close on the chemistry. Thanks to no good goalkeeper and no good centre back. That was a really, really nice draft at the end there as well. I thought we was going somewhere once we got those two team of the year centre backs, but it wasn't to be. Guys, that is going to be the end of the video for today. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like, rating, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And for now, guys, peace.